My new haircut makes me look like a little bit of a military commander general sort of thing. So in celebration of that, I put on one of these. Hell yeah. <laughs> How's it going everyone? Haven't made an actual real video in a long time. It's been it's been a long time since I've actually cared. Now if not obvious, I moved. I moved in a new area, a new bet a new better house. Now I'm not gonna specifically detail where I live because Now ever since my switch of locations, I've noticed little pesky little creatures that have been roaming about in my front yard. Now if you look at the presentation computer screen, then you may know what's been scurrying around and interrupting my livelihood. These pesky little lizards. These lizards are everywhere at my house, roaming the front yard, on my house walls, trying to sell me insurance. They are everywhere, specifically these little guys right here. Western fence lizards, or alternatively known as blue bellies, as seen by their blue bellies. I feel bad because this house was once empty, allowing all the lizards to roam around as they please without a worry. But now, ever since my arrival, they have been hiding away. They run away, and I don't want that. I don't want to scare away my brand new friends. Well, so what I want to do in this video is actually befriend the lizards. Make them feel comfortable in my presence. Let them know that I'm no danger. In this video, it is just going to be an experiment uh, me me trying to befriend the lizards and see if they they get used to the presence of man. Now this is day one of befriending the lizards. If you cannot see, there's a little lizard right there. Um, all I did was kind of just throw a worm at it. Now the lizard did know I was there. Um, it was staring at me the whole time I was doing this. Uh, and as you can see, it came up and had a worm. Now during day one, there was actually two lizards. This lizard is a completely different one that I didn't know it was there but it also came up and got a worm as well. Welcome to day two. Now you may be asking, Tristan, why are you putting so much effort and time into such a simple and stupid video? Well, I think it's cool, so just just keep crying. Just, just keep crying. Now, welcome to day two. I actually haven't gone outside yet, but I will soon. I'm gonna go out there and feed some more food, and we're, we're gonna see how cl we're gonna today. We're gonna test if we can be able to get them to trust my hand. We're gonna experiment, see if they'll uh, trust me enough where that I can hand feed them. What is the point of this video? It's pretty bright outside, so there may be a, um, a few more that might come up, and we'll see if we can get good shots of them. Go out there. Let's go out there and be befriend some lizards. First half of day two wasn't as exciting as day one. Uh, may I, was, I was thinking maybe it's too hot. Uh, maybe they're not hungry, so we're going to check back in an hour. I tried the I tried the front yard. I did see one, but wasn't unable to catch it on camera because it was too fast. But I threw some worms in the same spot so that uh, the lizards get to know that that's where their food comes from. That's where that's where the that that's where dinner is served. I tried the backyard as well because the lizards are also known to be found in the backyard.
Now it's day three. Uh, it's around 1 p.m. This is when the lizards really seem to thrive because of the sun is out. And it's really hot. But we're gonna go out there and see if they maybe if they if they if they got the hint that I feed them. I did see one uh, earlier today. It was in the spot where the worms used to be, where I did where I threw them. So maybe one of them has gotten the message. But let we'll, we'll go out there and see right now. Okay, so day three was uh, a lot better than day two. Uh, there was a lot more lizards, about four that I counted, and it's it, there's there's a lot of more action. Welcome to the aftermath of the experiment. Um, what was the point of the experiment? Well, I wanted to train the lizards to know that they could be comfortable and not run away from me, but they do that anyway. I did find the lizards coming back and forth to the area to find more food, but it probably wasn't because of they recognized me, but they probably just wanted more food. To be honest, the, the experiment wasn't much of an experiment of befriending the lizards, but feeding them and training them to go to a certain area where they get fed. My camera's gonna die so I'm gonna have to wrap this up, but I believe that the experiment was sort of a success. The lizards did find out eventually that I'm the one that, uh, eventually, they did find out eventually that they're being fed daily. The, I mean, it was, pretty, it was a pretty simple theme. I mean, just feeding lizards, hoping that they'll be able to trust me, but um, I believe that over the course of three days that they have been able to at least learn that what did they learn? Thank you for watching this video. Uh, maybe I could make more. You know, I think that it'll. I think you know I'm getting back into back into uh, the cycle of making more videos. Right, thank you for watching. It was pretty dumb, but like you know, you you decided to watch it, so don't blame me.